this simple problem is on buoyancy and its application to Newton's laws of motion. A helium balloon causes an upthrust of 0.1 Newton. If the mass of the balloon and helium is 6 point grams, calculate the acceleration of the balloon. So for example, we have this illustration right here. This is the balloon, so there's an upthrust or an upward force due to the air molecules of 0.1 Newton. And the weight of the balloon would just be equal to the mass of the balloon multiplied by the acceleration due to gravity. So if the weight, uh, if the mass of the balloon is 6 uh, grams, then we will divide that by 1,000 to make it kilograms. And that's going to become 0 0.006 kilograms. So therefore, the weight of this balloon would just be equal to 0 0.059 newtons that is 0 0.006 times 9.8 which will give us the weight of the balloon which is 0 0.059 newtons and it's asking us to calculate the acceleration of the balloon so we would use newton's second law which is f net is equal to ma and once again when we say f net we would look into the forces along the axis of the object's motion so this so this balloon is moving in the vertical axis so we will be looking into the forces along the vertical axis so we have the up thrust which is directed upward so i'm gonna have it positive let me call that up thrust this is the upward force minus the weight of the balloon so minus w is equal to m times a or the mass of the balloon times the acceleration of the balloon let's substitute the values now so the up thrust is 0 0.1 newton minus the weight of the balloon which is equal to um, mg or 0 0.059 newton so let's substitute that 0 0.059 newton is equal to the mass of the balloon and once again the mass should be in kilograms so if it's six grams we need to divide it by 1000 so the mass is going to be 0 0.006 kilograms times the acceleration which is what's being asked in this problem putting these values in your calculator you'll get the acceleration is equal to 6.8 meters per second square